What is up, YouTube? This is Fortress Striker. Um. Okay, you're just not gonna fucking believe this shit because I just went down on Facebook, just scrolling down, and I went to fucking Wikipedia, and this has been announced. God. We just lost another WWE legend. Ladies and gentlemen. We lost Dusty Rhodes a week month ago. This year, we just lost Roddy Piper. Rowdy Ruddy Piper is dead. It's said that he died of a natural cause today. Oh my God! I can't believe this. We just lost another legend. I'm not. I'm not. This is not. Um, this is why, ladies and gentlemen, losing this legend was something we did not want. I just can't believe he's he's gone now to wrestling heaven with Randy Savage, Ultimate Warrior, and Rhodes. This is the hardest moment in history. We just lost one of the greatest old school heels, promo talks, and fan favorite guys of all the time. We just, I mean, it was just about, about like what, a month ago he just said goodbye to Dusty. Now, we just lost Piper. Piper's gone. He was one of the greatest legends of all time. He was a former Intercontinental Champion. Tag champion, U.S. champion. The guy was a legend. He was one of the greatest talks of all time. He made history in round during the times of beginning of WrestleMania. He made uh, a lot of moments, a lot of rivalries. He did a lot of things in his career that all of us respectively loved and be proud of. He's a Hall of Famer. He was a uh, one of the greatest legends of all time. Now. He's gone. This shocked me. Just now. Literally. Because I just saw this now. Because remember, before we had Punk, before we had Austin, we had Piper. Alright? And during the ages of during the 80s, Roddy Piper was one of the greatest talents that wrestling history had. His finisher was a sleeper holder. He had great matches. He was even had one of his famous WrestleMania matches with, not only with uh, teaming with Paul Lorendorf, taking on Mr. T and Hulk Hogan at WrestleMania 1, and then boxing Mr. T at WrestleMania 2 the year after. But mostly my, our famous one I can say was WrestleMania 8 for the Intercontinental Championship against Bret Hart. It was one of the greatest classic matches between two technical wrestlers, which is, by the way, for those who don't know, uh, Piper was actually Canadian. He actually is a relative to the Hart family, and so he is now... In um, wrestling heaven with his cousin Owen. Uh, for those who don't know, it is currently raining outside. It's thundering. It's raining. I think the angels are now crying to see another legend gone. I haven't seen like a rain like this, you know, since uh, for those who know Paul Walker when he died. I know he was not a wrestler, but it was ironic to see how it rained so hard and we lost a, a famous actor. This is how much it is now when you're a wrestling fan. Roddy Piper passing away is one of the saddest moments to happen. And I want to say I am so sorry to see such a legend gone by. He died at the age of 61. He was will be, of course, Miss. He is a legend. A wrestler and one of the greatest icons we have ever seen in the history of this business. You will really expect to see a soon to be a in memory of to him in the WWE since he was actually more famous in the WWE. The guy made a lot of legacies. The guy made a lot of histories there. He even come up to even fought up against Vince Russo and TNA to talk about all the deaths of um, the legends, especially Owen. He fought for him. 
And Piper is great for all his promos. If you want to go check his promos, go check it out. If you want to check out his wrestlings, go check it out. This guy is a legend. I respect him. I loved him. This guy was awesome. And sad to never been a world champion. I am so sorry about that. But you know what? This guy is a champion. Because now he's the next number one contender up in wrestling heaven for the heaven title. And I hope to see a lot of people get more respect. So now we lost Rhodes. We now lost Piper. But I say thank you to him. Thank you to the both of them for being there for us. Piper was actually fighting back for Hogan's sake for the whole racism we had that we dealt with uh, about a week ago. So, and especially talked about Rhodes' um, farewell to what he had left in here on Earth. So, please give this a like to the legendary Rowdy Rowdy Piper for Hot Rod himself. Comment, what, would you, what was your greatest moment about this man? Share this to everyone so they know what happened. Subscribe if you're new. Like my Facebook page. And this is Fortress Striker saying, Hot Rod for life.